Hi everyone, so this is our short how-to video for lab number five. So we're going to be covering viscosity. Once again, I'm in our Blackboard site, so I'm going to go to 5.2 lab viscosity. So let's click on that and we'll check this out. So in lab five, again, we're going to be talking about viscosity. So in this lab, our learning goals are one, to discuss viscosity, two, um, would be the factors that actually affect viscosity what the rate of flow is and how to calculate it. So yes, you're going to need your calculators, so break them out. And factors that affect volcanic eruptions. And lastly, the different types of eruptions. So the instructions for this are as follow. So down below, there's going to be short little videos that you can click to watch for each part. So there's going to be four different parts of this lab. So part one is corn syrup viscosity. So this is going to be the most time consuming. I have a list of what your required materials are. So you can use corn syrup, um, but we can also use some different substitutions if you can't find corn syrup. Um, so some good substitutions for the dark corn syrup are maple syrup, and then for light would be honey. So you're going to get the same sort of results when we're using this. Now for part two, you don't have to do any of it, just watch the video and answer some questions. But hey, if you wanna have a little bit of fun, you can always go ahead and do the baking soda and vinegar, and then same for part three, which is Mentos and Diet Coke. And again, again for part four, dancing raisins, don't have to do it, just make sure you answer your questions. So down here, I have Lab 5 already downloaded, so you can get a good idea. Let's scroll back up to the top. So this, in part one, it's corn syrup viscosity. It goes over all your required materials and the instructions for that. Same for part two, part three, and part four. Do not forget to fill out this chart for part five. Um, or lab five part one for corn syrup viscosity and answer the following questions. If you have any questions, please let me know. I'm here to help you out. Thanks.